The time is 3.55 and we are going to Turkey, Antalya! <laughs> Thank you. Right, so guys, I'm in Turkey, Antalya, Turkey. Hello. I'm so freaking gassed. I can't believe that I'm on holiday alone. Number one, that's a massive achievement. And number two, I just feel so insanely blessed right now. I'm currently on the beach with ice cream, glass of wine, and hookah. Um, so yeah, I'm going down to breakfast now. I woke up at like 7.29. Plan for today is just to go to the city and do some shopping, look around, look at the landmarks, take pictures and live my best life. I didn't like the food so I opted for some Lucky Charms. There's Karina, a little kitty. Girl is ready. Ready but not dressed. So this driver is on some need for speed shit. But right now I'm at Hadrian's Gate. I took like loads of pictures. It's a little thing over there which is really cute. I've got like shit loads of pictures here and I've also just took some pictures here which are stunning so I'm gonna carry on with my day. Probably gonna get one of these when the guy comes back. Thank you. So apple, pomegranate, ginger. ginger. Eucalyptus. Oh for the, mmm, okay. Ginseng. Ginger. Ginger. Woo! Woo! Day. I'm I basically went back to the hotel after being in um, I think it was Old Town slash city centre. Decided to do a little outfit change because what I was wearing, oh my god, it was like what I was wearing was like it was like hot weather friendly, but because my skirt had inner lining, it was just it was mad peak. So I'm gonna take my book and me down to the poolside area and I'm gonna chill. I'm really living my best life right now. I really am. Right, so hopefully where we last left this vlog, I had just come back upstairs after having dinner. And yeah, so um, recap. When I was having dinner, I expected it to be the same dinner every single day of the trip. They, they change the food every day. <laughs> Grateful, loving it, hella gratitude, thank you God. And peace out for today. I'm gonna head out, just had breakfast delicious as always had pancakes today um yeah i'm just gonna get ready make myself look cuter but i am up and ready to leave my house so basically now i'm just packing a bag because obviously i'm traveling alone if i haven't mentioned that already um so i need to have everything 
I need so like money more sunscreen and I'm like an over planner slash over packer so I'll take the whole house if I have the opportunity this is where I'm going this is exactly where I'm going Like this year. Look at me here. Touch your gun. So that tall thing right there is my hotel. And this is what I can see when I'm in it. Isn't that stunning? No, thank you. <laughs> all right so update um i was sitting opposite dude and waterfalls for a good two hours just doing shisha and chilling and then i realized that i had eaten ice cream and fanta and my stomach was like bloop, bloop. i can't just go to any toilet so at the moment the only toilet i trust is my hotel toilet so I was just like, okay, I've got to go back to my hotel, you know, bust the shit. <laughs> so guys, I have met someone from the UK yeah. and it is her birthday yeah, and we're right. currently in the city about to go eat. So that is what Thank we're doing right now. Say hi to the vlog. <laughs> it's her birthday. <laughs> I, I'm scared. I'm What's done. Noni. Noni, do you think you don't have Noni? Like, they're actually out here digging for bits of this place to put it back together. Like, I think that is just crazy. Like, I can't even believe it. Sorry, I forgot to mention the fact that um, I had lunch earlier and that was where you saw like the really beautiful blue sea so now we've now driven to somewhere else which is called side so we've got an hour to just like look around buy stuff that we want to and i'm here for the views to be honest it's stunning So I'm back at my hotel. Um, if my day didn't make sense to you, what I was doing is basically I booked like a tour around like the different cities close to Antalya, which is where I'm currently staying. And it just took us to places like the waterfall, like ancient Greek buildings that had broken down that they were trying to rebuild, that kind of stuff today. So yesterday I actually found someone that is from the UK as well and she happens to be in the room next to me which is also even crazier and um, we just decided to go out for dinner because it was her birthday so that was really really nice it was nice and chill um, and I also do love like making friends on holiday I think it's like so important because the girl next door she's also solo traveling as well and obviously I am so it's nice to have someone who's just next door so I'm about to go on a jeep safari, like the jeeps are somewhere behind me. Bah. Thank you. 
this is the view from behind me. I, I'm at like a village family's house and I want to take this aloe vera here because I know it's great for your skin but obviously I'm not going to do it because I'm not a rude guest. Oh, good. Thank you. You understand me? We have Apparently I'm more interested than Turkey. One, two, three fish. <laughs> so we just stopped off and had lunch and this is my current setting. There's a mountain up there. Right, so I'm on another tour and we pulled up to have breakfast and this is what I'm eating. I don't even know what it is but it took me like an hour to translate to the person what I actually wanted if it had meat in it. So right now I'm in a Turkish cave. I don't really know the specifics because as I mentioned before the guy is not speaking English and my translator keeps falling asleep. <laughs> Ready for the tea. Show him the address. Okay, one, two, three. Go picture. Okay. So we're out here in the wilderness. Mm -hmm. Out the here wilderness. In, in the sticks. With actual sticks. Trying to find the harbour. No, I think it's down there somewhere. Oh my god! It's cute, right? <laughs> So right now she's finessing us a boat ride. What did he say? I don't want a boat ride where it's chairs it's, though. It's going to big waterfall to down right now. Yeah, come on, I've been there already. No, no, I can make a cheaper spread, no problem. Yeah, but there's no. I want to lay down somewhere and have the wind in my hair. Are you sure this is safe? I can help you, lady. Ciao, ciao, ciao. Yeah. Guys, I'm going on a boat ride. <laughs> I was saying, guys. She said, guys, I'm going on a boat ride. Wait, hold on, wait. Wow. So this girl here convinced me to get on this. Guys, I'm going on a boat ride. Listen, where we could have been on that. I'm so excited. We could have been on that. Okay, so it's not your yacht. Are you mad? Look where, Look where we are. <laughs> <laughs> we it's could have so been on I'm done. <laughs> Oh, are you mad? Look at your knees! Girl, come on! <laughs> you know this is <laughs> She said, girl, come on! <laughs> Do you know how much convincing it took to get me on this baby boat? Could it a trouble lunch, bro? <laughs> <laughs> it's crusty! <laughs> probably tell by the background I am back home right now um, I got back yesterday overall I would say my trip to Turkey was absolutely amazing not only is it inspired me to travel more because I feel like more of an independent lady 
but it also has made me feel um, more empowered. So it means that not only did I find out a lot about myself, um, I found out that I am, I knew I was very independent. I like doing stuff by myself anyway, but I realized that me going on holiday by myself, doing literally everything that I wanted to do, ticking off everything I had on my list when I came to Antalya was just so fulfilling and Honestly, I prefer going on a holiday by myself than with people, if I'm being totally honest. I'm even looking at holidays to book because I'm having trypophobia, like I need to have a book right now. And, like, and as I said before, I don't really vlog um, my trips for other people. I mainly do it for myself because I like to look back on my holidays and kind of relive the memories. And it might look like I'm avoiding eye contact with the camera, but the sun is literally inside my soul right now. So I can't actually see properly. And to move the camera, it's just, I'm not about to do it realistically. I'm very tired. <laughs> but um, yeah, thank you to everyone that gave me like such kind words. Um, and hopefully I inspired you guys to travel alone as well. And stay tuned because I will be recording many more solo travel trips. So I really would advise you to subscribe, but that's enough for me. I've done enough talking, so see you later.